And welcome everybody here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for the final Pike adventure. We are now going to face Victor, the final, final boss with Pike. If you watched our last uh, battle against Nautilus, you could see that Pike is really good and just the Pike deck is really good once you have this level eight power that shows that all of your, um, all of your allies become lurkers, makes life a lot better. All right, so we ended the Nautilus at level 12. We're now going to get two additional rerolls. Um, we're still you know, using the plus two, plus one Warhammer for our relic. And uh, that's going to kind of be about it. So, you know, let's just get back to it. Uh, I'm expecting some good things again against Victor. We already showed how powerful our deck is against Nautilus. And uh, I think the Nautilus fight's maybe even just a tad bit tougher than the Victor fight at times. But let's see what we get for our opening power. Anything good? Okay, nothing good. So we'll go ahead and reroll because we got our two extra rerolls now. Um, when you summon an ally, give it plus one, plus one this round is not too bad. But we could really do a lot better than that. I'm going to go ahead and use another reroll. Three chrono breaks for everybody's a dragon. It has fury. Hmm. I guess we could do the chrono breaks. Yeah, uh, no, because Colonel Breaks make us has us. Yeah, that makes us miss Lurk, so we don't want that. All right, when you summon an ally, give it Challenger this round. Man, these are pretty weak. All right, last three roll. All right, random keywords. Welcome gifts. Love random keywords. Okay, we don't need any rerolls anyway. We're good. We're good. Everybody's gonna get keywords. Rerolls overrated. All right, we got two pikes in hand. Uh, we'll go ahead and I guess we'll send one back. We'll send that bone skewer back. Remember, we want to cut the spells, so we have the two spells in our deck: bone skewer and um, chum the waters. And those are the two that we want to cut. Let us leave with you. Spell shield. Hopefully we can cut those later. And we're going to try to not acquire any spells whatsoever, if we can help it. Kill my elusive hatchling. Rude. Alright, elusive tre treasure seeker. Man, there, this Plaza Guardian is getting pretty excited over here. Alright, we continue to hit Lurk. Very good. Yes, keep hitting Lurk. But it wasn't Pike. We're in. We're <clears throat> we got pretty good odds of missing Lurk now, so maybe I should play this Blood Bait. Yeah, I should just play the Blood Bait, and then we can attack again next round. The old Regen Ephemeral. All right, that will do. First, first one done. No rerolls left, but we don't need it. Okay, so we get more petty officers, or the Star Shepherd. Kind of like the Star Shepherd. You know, so it's just a zero three, but lurk. It will grow. So you know, like a one three, then two three, then three three, stuff like that. Maybe Petty Officer is better, but we already... I just don't like three mana cards. I like one mana cards. I'll take the Star Shepherd. Okay, reinforcements. Some Somebody good. Yuck. I guess... Ugh. 
Because, see, we don't want any spells for Lee Sin. I definitely don't want this thing. No rerolls left. All right, Scion. Uh, Scion's kind of yuck. All right, Lee Sin it is. The Sonic, because the Sonic Wave could be good. All right, I always like going this way. I don't like going towards this thing. This one makes all of the... Every single unit set their stats to 2-5. That one's gross. <laughs> don't like that. I don't want to have two five pikes. Lisa and Lurk. Got the old Lisa and Lurk deck. Alright, so we now have six spells in the deck. Lifesteal. Oh, they didn't play anything? I was going to have them play something, then I was going to play this, this, so. Got punished, should have just attacked and lurked. Being greedy. Alright, we hit. We hit Pike. We haven't had, like, any Pikes this whole time. And obviously we can just take five. Oh wait, never mind. They gave that challenger. Rude. Oh, then fearsome. All right, well we can take two because we have. Um... You know, light steel. All right, so there's seven for Pike. I could have just played the hammer snout. That would have been the exact same thing. That would we'll just attack for more. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. Finally, some action. Okay, so chum the waters will make five power if they if they attack. We can block with that. So obviously, we don't want to block with Pike. Alright, we got life steal. Oh, you're all so cute. Don't have overwhelm. Another life steal. Man, Pike's pretty cool. Alright, they're down to eight. He's in. Lisa and Lurk deck. Sure. I'm gladly kill that thing. I w definitely wanted Lee Sin over that thing anyway. <laughs> yeah, we get Death from Below as a spell for Lee. Uh, oh, we're already at 30. I was going to say move that over for the life stealers, but we're at 30 anyway. Whatever. <laughs> Lee Pike, tier one. <laughs> yeah, death from below is your spell for Lee. Huge synergy here. Uh, oh, I like both of these. Right? You know, drawing extra cards is always good. But then getting Scout. Scout's pretty cool. 
Um, I could see either one. I think we just want to draw cards, probably. We'll draw a card. Alright, gold chest or Zonite Urchin? We'll go Zonite Urchin. Game start, draw two? Sure. We'll get a new power. We'll take a game start, draw two. Especially with having all these, like, one drops and stuff. Sounds good. And then hopefully with us having that power... No, never mind. I was going to say, like, hopefully if we have that power, then they won't give us the option to, um, to get that power later again. But no, we can still get it again. All right, we'll go Fearsome. Fearsome Quick Attack. Lurk. Yeah. We're doing this hard mode, you know, with no rerolls after that part. That first one. Final boss, no rerolls. Elusive. Okay, we'll triple spell with one drops. Greed'll turn any man into a monster. Osu can sniff out any star anywhere. Oh, Miss Lurk. Oh, no, Miss Lurk. I'm sorry, Star Shepherd. It got scout for the keyword. We get another attack. Ah, too bad we're in this lurk again, though. Yeah, tomorrow's going to be our meme tier Monday stream. Sunday edition. If I could only just play this Shadow Assassin and then draw a card and then be able to attack again to reset. Really need to attack. I guess. I guess. Yeah, that's fine. Get six points of damage in. Um, I'm pretty sure. I'll check. Oh, but when I draw on Wood Head Punk? Down to three. I didn't, didn't do a very good job in this game of like killing them super fast. Yeah, I already have donation decks for tomorrow. Yep. Win check. Yep. Yep, I got three. These are five twos. I don't really want my bike to die. Could probably do this better. Thought about doing some football watch parties on Sundays. Um, no, because I think I don't want to get in trouble. I think there's, you know, against the rules of. I'm sure it's probably against the rules of broadcasting. NFL games. Pike with Scout. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> they're they're giving their, you know, <laughs> they're doing their celebration while we're killing them. Yeah. Yeah. So just don't want to mess with that. All right, Swole Squirrel plus three plus one. 
I'm in there. Gets gets wool. Okay, champion item. Could go with spell shield for the pike. You know, it's either spell shield or plus two plus zero. You know, the plus two plus zero help it uh, you know, level up on one shot. The spell shield means, remember, it's getting a random keyword anyway, so that like it won't be spell shield, so it'll get a different keyword. I think I'm gonna go with that. So that means that we'll always have spell shield, and so then it's gonna get another keyword. So we can either go towards the card shop or the healer. How are we doing on money? 300 monies? Kinda wanna go towards the healer. Try to cut. Yes, cut a spell. All right, on to his ear. So now we have four spells in our deck that don't trigger lurk. We definitely want to kill Azir quickly before they start getting the Emperor's armies all over. Let's see. Send all of you back, though. All right, we got Pike. <clears throat> got two Pikes. All right, the Sharkling's a better blocker. See, tough. All right, 19. So we don't need to play the Snapjaw Swarm because we're going to be able to attack anyway. So let's get two more one drops. Yeah, Azir is pretty crazy. You got to kill Azir fast because once it starts getting to like this six mana spell, I think it's a six mana spell, the thing that puts the six Sand Soldiers in play gets pretty out of hand. You need a pulse, but you will witness. Miss Lurk again. Ugh. Always missing Lurk. So the Azir has Fury. Oh, I should I should definitely go the other way on that, obviously, because then the Azir would be a 3-2 instead of a 3-3. Three, three. Alright, let's, let's see what keyword we have. Augment? How is Augment even a keyword? Alright, you're a scout. Alright, so I don't really need to scout attack. Alright, you're gonna attack, you're gonna attack. And I think the rest of y'all can chill for a minute. Swole Squirrel, elusive Swole Squirrel. What's up? Um, send it on in there, or so they're probably gonna play the thing that gets them uh, two Sand Soldier blockers burst speed. Hmm. So maybe we just send in one first. Oh, okay. You shall all bow to your emperor. You shall die to that death. It's also elusive? Uh, yeah, they're at 23. I don't know if this is worth it. This gets rid of both their blockers, of course. I definitely mapped that out. Alright. Victory over Azir. New power. I guess if I would have gone towards the card shop, we would have bought a reroll. Alright, take the unit. So that's Wool Squirrel getting big. New power. Everything have overwhelm. Round start rally. Oh, no, no. Uh, I don't want any of these powers. So obviously we're not casting slow spells, so that doesn't matter. I mean, I guess we have Chum the Waters. 
Um, I don't want to put Chrono Breaks in the deck because they miss Lurk, but they do Rally, so that's cool, but they miss Lurk, so that's not cool. I guess we can reduce the power of stuff, I guess. We're just not a very good Enfeebling Strike deck. Oh well. Uh, this is a champion item? Oh no, Spells Chest? Yuck. Adaptatron, that's one where you can purchase like all the different uh, turrets and stuff. We could just go, this is another This is another power, so we could just go towards the power. Um, let's do that, because I think actually, so you can get the power here and then fight Victor immediately. You know, if we're going for like speed, you can do that, but I think you can actually also go back this way. Um, so let's just go get this power. I think you can go either way. We probably could just fight Victor right now. I don't I don't really see Victor defeating us. Get rid of you, get rid of you. I could even see maybe sending Pike back. Alright, well at least we're starting with Man, no one drops? Finally. <laughs> I was gonna say, we have so many one drops in our deck. Where are they at? So there's four cards in our deck that miss Lurk. We have two of them in our opening hands. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we have nine cards right now. Yeah, I want to play this on... I don't want to play this right now. I guess I could play the Star Shepherd. But I won't. Won't find better this side of the sun. Challenger. Augment. No refunds. Oh, you're all so cute. Alright, we gotta go pike next round, right? I mean playing Swole Squirrels is pretty enticing, but I assume we're supposed to just play Pike. Challenger. I'll challenge. You. No. Yeah, that thing's Nexus Strike. Okay. So it's gonna trade with the Snapjaw Swarm. That's fine. Come on me. Pay debt. All right, we're going to be burning a card. Sharkling, no, my one drops. Decide to show up. <laughs> Six Challenger. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, they get, ex is it exact copy? Oh, no, with Challenger and everything. Uh. Now they can challenge my pike. They're just doing one damage to my regen. <laughs> okay, good. They didn't challenge Pike. Cool squirrel. Reporting for duty. Alright, they're turning that into a swole squirrel also, that's fine. Hmm. Still have two mana. Get him, Pike. Take out the squirrels. Alright, they're down to two. We have a couple 24-7 squirrels. 
How are squirrels so big? They're just squirrels. 24 sevens. Man, these squirrels can fight all day, if you know what I mean. You can just call them 7-Eleven. Because they're... These squirrels are ready to fight 24-7. Oh, Lifesteal? Lifesteal Pike? Dude, labs are cool. Not taking that damage. Not gonna happen. I did just risk dying to Puff Caps by doing that. By dying, I mean taking a point of damage to Puff Caps. Alright, but that will be a victory. All right, new power. Uh, give it challenger this round. That does mean whenever we're getting our random powers, none of them will get challenger for the random power. Okay, so they get like other ones like life steal and stuff. Yeah, so I've always gone towards Victor. So I guess we could go back this way if we want and keep fighting stuff. So it's basically, do we want to go for the S rating on time? And you know, if we do that, we go straight to Victor. Or do we want to go for the S rating on wealth and go this way? Probably just go for... I guess you can just go for time. Like, we're going to beat Victor. Might as well just go for Victor. And plus, we're at 30 health right now. So, like, if we can defeat Victor without taking any damage, if we're lucky enough to do that, then we can, you know, get the S tier rating on health. So we're not going to get wealth, but we could get health and time, potentially. All right, send all of you back. That hand looks a little better. Get our four drops. You know what my future is? Glorious. Six four. Six four, pretty big. Maybe they don't block. Darn, they block. All right, doesn't look like we're getting the health. Unless we hit life steal, which we could definitely hit life steal with different oh, stuff. So I got a new one. Hey, life steal! Oh no, I didn't see that they had challenger on theirs. No, I should have waited till after combat and then played that. You have overwhelm. Okay, so we're back to 30. We do have big squirrels that can fight Victor. As well as Big Pike, but we'll we'll go and start it off with the squirrel. Ooh, they got a lifesteal elusive. Oh, this got Oh, it got Challenger and Challenger this round. So the Challenger this round doesn't stop. Does it make sure they get different powers? I guess we could just do that. Keep it 24 alive. Hmm. Getting back to 30 health is going to be tough unless we hit some lifesteal. Alright, this was elusive. Yeah, so I guess the gift happens first because that was our first power that we, that we grabbed. Oh, 
We're gonna need some life steel. We wanna go back up to 30. We're gonna get life steel. You life steal? No. No life steal anywhere. I could slow down on killing them, right? I could kill them a little bit slower to look for life steal, but then that hurts the the time variant. I gotta gain 12 health. That's not easy with the things I have left. Only I can endure the dragon's fury. No life steal. My license. They have the MKs, yeah, the MK2, so that kills the squirrel. I guess I should have just blocked with Lee Sin. Okay, there's a life steal. We gotta gain 12 health. I can gain like 11. Alright, what do you give me? Because I can use this for another plus two. Oh, that's regen, not life steal. Uh, here. Life steal? Okay. I've been waiting for this. No, come on. Why did I use the dragon protection on it? Yeah, of course I drew the MK3 and I didn't I didn't think of that. I should use the dragon protection on it. Yep, yep, yep. I was even thinking, so I was thinking, I was like, alright, we could almost get to 30, and then we can use the Bone Skewer to finish up the rest of the 30. Alright, putting Pike back on top, so we'll draw Pike, and so it's going to be our last chance. Because Pike will be 12 power, right, so yeah, so this is our last chance. Nope. All right. Well, we're just gonna finish it out. All right. Didn't get the wealth. Or didn't get the health. Sorry. So didn't get the health. Didn't get the wealth. Hopefully got fast enough, man. If we like are one minute slow, cause I wasted those those the last two rounds. I'll be sad, but. There we go. 360 reputation, defeating Victor. Adventure complete. When I level up Rally? Whoa, that's a new one. We got a new relic a new relic item. When I level up Rally. Dude, that's a good one. <gasps> no, and I I messed up the speed also. Oh, we didn't get an S on any of them. 25 minutes? Speed was A. I guess it's gotta be under 25, right? So it's gotta be 24. Oh, I bet if I would have just Finish it out originally. I got so punished. All right, I deserve it. I deserve it. But that's all right. We're going to be, you know, I'm going to have to go back and replay these anyway, because, of course, we want to uh, get Pike up to level 22. So now we're going to earn 10% more gold. So that's going to help out with the wealth. Um, and then also, oh, we get a common relic slot as well. Okay, so I'm going to have to go back and replay those anyway, because we got to level up Pike all the way to get to level 22 before we attempt the pike speed run. I think the pike could be a really fast champion with the speed runs as we were seeing with those of like, especially um, the lurk, you know, the upgraded starting power, our original, like the OG lurkers will have plus two, plus two. And we saw that just get a lot of one and two mana lurkers. 
I think the pike will probably be pretty fast. Okay, so that is completing the original adventure though, showing you, uh, you know, pikes kind of easy once you get that level eight. The hard part with pike, the challenge, is before you're at level eight, before you get that starting power. And of course, you can see that whenever uh, you watch the previous videos, if you haven't checked those out with pike. All right, fun champion to play though. I, this is a, this is a fun one with the path of champions. Anyway, those of y'all watching later on YouTube, hit that like button over there. And as always, leave those comments. Let me know how you like Pike, the Pike adventure. Let me know which other champions you want to see up next. Anything like that, the new cards coming out. Always love seeing y'all's comments. But um, thank you so much for watching the Pike Path of Champions adventures. Can't say that enough. And I will see you for the next video.